Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Seems that everybody has a Twitter account these days. I have a Twitter account, twitter.com slash Chris Perillo. You can follow me there, and sometimes I, I might follow you back. I used to follow everybody back, but then uh, I kind of got ahead of me, and I've got about 70,000-plus followers at this point in time, and no, I don't read everything that everybody happens to tweet. I never get any sleep, you know, as opposed to now when I'm recording this video at 1.52 in the morning. <clears throat> so... If you have a Twitter account, uh, then you may want to pay attention to this particular resource, especially if you have a Twitter account and you have a website, because the, the two could kind of cross over. So if you have a website, chances are you're looking to get feedback from the people who visit your website. Sometimes getting that feedback is kind of difficult. Uh, so uh, the same team who uh, helped bring you contests.perillo.com have also assembled this tool to help you get feedback from your website visitors and just use their Twitter accounts. So they basically tweet from their account. It's collected in a, a widget that anybody can view. And then it's integrated in your website. You simply uh, paste the code into your website. People visit. They leave feedback through their own Twitter accounts. And then uh, those responses, as they're tweeted out, can be ranked. So let's say someone visits your webpage, and they say, you know what, yeah, I really want it to be more green. And they're not the only one who thinks that it needs to be more green. So then five other people say, yeah, I like it. I want to I wanna, I wanna, I wanna say this, uh, that this is a good thing, you know, a thumbs up right here. So they could retweet the same thing, and then soon you're going to see that, well, five of your visitors think that your website needs to be green. So again, all you need to do is embed this tool in your website, and the people who visit, so long as they have a Twitter account, can use their Twitter account to provide feedback for your website. It's really kind of that simple. It's the same way that uh, we've done contests in the past through contests.perillo.com. We've used Twitter. Uh, you'd basically retweet something or tweet uh, a response, and then it would be picked up uh, by the tool on the website. So the website uh, where you can get this widget to embed is twiffeedback. Dot com. Let me zoom in here. Twifeedback.com. That's T W I feedback.com. Of course, T W I short for Twitter. And uh, you, you simply, well, it's like a step one, two, three, and, and you're done. Uh, and then you get this widget that anybody could look at. In fact, if I scroll over here to the left side of the page and click feedback, uh, this, uh, well, let me click it again here. There we go. Uh, the widget will pull up here in the middle of the, the web page and say, how can we make uh, Twiff feedback better? Feedback in 140 characters or less. So it gives us the starting point, and then I, I would type something in and then press send, or I can browse what other people are saying. Uh, someone says, a few more color themes would be awesome. If I agree with that, I do a thumbs up. So there's seven people who would agree. Uh, then there's ne you can even do negative numbers. See, the, the tab feature is dope. How do I implement it? Negative two. Uh, so you can see other people's feedback for what's on the page. You can post your own feedback using your own Twitter account. And, uh, you know, it's, it's just a, a, an interesting way of getting feedback. And I, I, the reason why I like this, uh, not just because I, I know the people who developed it, they happen to be local here to Seattle, uh, is because, you know, when, when people are talking about you on Twitter, it's usually a pretty good thing. That, that's attention. You, you want that. Uh, so uh, at some point... In the future, you may very well see uh, Twiff feedback integrated in my blog at chris.perillo.com, potentially at geeks.perillo.com, although I don't really control that platform. Uh, lockernome.com, coupons.lockernome.com, uh, you know, anywhere that I have a web presence. Downloads.lockernome.com, coupons.lockernome.com. Did I already say coupons? If I did, I apologize. It is, after all, 1.52 in the morning, and I need to get some sleep. So I will tell you that my email address is chris at perillo.com if you have any other interesting resources to pass along, no matter what they happen to be about, related to, software, hardware, whatever. I'll, I'll take a look. I'll, I'll give you, you know, my take. I'll give you a little bit of feedback. If you give me your feedback through this widget or not, Geeks.perillo.com, I already mentioned, is a place where uh, the rest of our community is hanging out, embedding their own YouTube videos, posting blog posts, participating in forums. We've also got chat room as well. Uh, that's, uh, uh, you know, 
typically talking tech. Yeah, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, even if I'm not here. And if I'm in bed, there are people that are still going to be chatting right here. It's crazy. It's what the internet is. Always online. So are we at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.